hello everyone in today's video i will show you how you can create this in splash animation inside CapCut pc so let's get started first i need to bring in this article into my timeline and make sure to adjust it wherever you want then i will bring this overlay into the timeline you can find this overlay into the, in the description below and these are two so i will just select the first one and make sure to cut all these if you want to make this more slow or you want to extend this and extend this too but this won't extend so you can simply just click it and then go to speed and decrease the speed like this so it will extend but it will be a lot slower so i will make sure to just keep it right here now once this is done i will just bring in a red background you can bring any background you want like this and then i will just go to blend mode and playing the blend mode to screen it will be like this then select both background and the ink splash overlay and then right click and make it a compound clip like this now just go to remove bg chroma key and select the white color like this now go back to basics then in the blend mode and you can choose darken like this so this will be our animation now i will bring in my character like this and go to remove vg remove its background like this and just place it right here in the middle now what i need to do i will just select the overlay layer and make sure to place it like this so that it fills the screen like this so at the start it will be like this if you it's not looking good just make it down and you can choose this as well now if you want to make this more documentary type you can go to effects and then apply a dark knight effect to this layer and then adjust its settings or you can just copy mine like this and then again apply this to this layer as well then just simply decrease these things filter textures according to your video and as you can see your video is good to go now if you want you can also add some sound effect now i will just go to cap cut library sound effects and then impact like this i will just simply make sure to drag it here and now you can see our animation will be looking like this so if you found this tutorial helpful make sure to like and subscribe to my channel for more amazing content like this and i will see you in the next one until then take care and bye